watching this vlog with M. We are on the way to the Beauty Box Awards at the Gherkin, which I've actually never been in the Gherkin before. Have you? No, I haven't actually. I'm really excited. Yeah, it's exciting, but we are in a bit of a rush. Yeah, but it's okay. Starts in two minutes. Oh, starts in two minutes. Luckily, M lives right next to an, Uber, um, an underground station, so we're just gonna walk there, direct line to the Gherkin. Yes. That's that really. What's the closest one called? Bank? Bank. Bank. Okay. So we're going straight to Bank. Is your Bank's the closest one? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's it really. Tomorrow we're going skiing, so I'm bringing you along with me there. You're right next to a Primark. I know. <laughs> all the essentials unreal <laughs> So I have spent the whole day traveling and you never guess where I am. My favorite place in the whole entire world. I'm in Avorias. I absolutely love it here. Right, so we've just literally arrived in our apartment. And can I just say how cute, like can we actually cope? What is this? What is this, honey? This? Is this just a massive jar of honey? Oh, that's lovely. Mm, I'll have to try it. Is it honey? I think so. Oh, look. Oh, is this to make hot honey? Oh, what is this? No, we're coming across like freaking idiots right now, aren't we? Well, this isn't <laughs> like a normal thing you get in England, <laughs> is it? I'm assuming this is jam. Oh, a little surprise for you. We are pleased to offer these local products to you. We apologise for the current prohibited access to the balconies and we wish you a nice journey in our residence. What does that say about the balcony? So, guys, I'm so annoyed because we've just got here. I know, obviously, there's bigger things in life to be annoyed about. Oh, my goodness, look. They're the people that save people halfway up the mountain. And th we can't go on the balcony. So now I can't even take a picture on the balcony. And I'm quite upset about it, to be honest, but it is what it is. We're going to ask the people if we can go in it anyway, but probably not. Anyway, so there's two, there's actually, there's four people who can actually sleep in this apartment. Emily, if we knew this... I know. We could have brought, brought people. people. Like, there's literally four, there's a two single beds and a double bed here. Like, when, bearing in mind, the most expensive part about skiing is West hotel. Side, yeah. If they said, like, oh, by the way... Because then it's not just you that they're giving, it's like loads of people. Yeah. We could have made like, well, we're going to have fun just us, us two anyway. I was going to say us four. Oh, look, the kitchen, uh, the kitchen, the shower's nice. I think the toilet's in there. Yeah, we've just been travelling about Europe. And we finally made it, all in one piece. And we're going to, well, Foule Douche closes at seven, so not going to go to Foule Douche. Also, how cute are my moon boots? I'm literally obsessed. I got them from ASOS. Got a little moon boot logo there, and they're fluffy, and they're short, which is going to actually much prefer the short ones. Last year, I got the champagne ones, and I got the sparkly long ones, and they were both long. And because I've got bigger, to be honest, I've got bigger legs than like normal people. No, not bigger legs. I just mean like I put on, if I was going to put on white, I'd put it on my legs. And what I'm trying to say is that they, the boots always slid down. So anyway, now I'm going to do my makeup. And I can't wait. I can't wait to be here. I'm so excited. Hey guys, we are all ready. I have gone this way. Car park. Are you sure? Oh, is this where? Yeah, this is where we yeah. that time. I'm wearing pink and white. PLT kindly sent me this jacket and these leggings and I'm obsessed. Em's outfit, I'm not being funny. 
but can you actually cope? This sisters and, is it sisters and seekers? Yeah. Jumper was from last year, and because I like to experiment with my clothes, so I was like, I'll bring it, but I don't think I'll wear it. And I was like, no, that looks unreal. The jacket is from. I'm obsessed. I've never dressed like this, and I'm loving it. Have you not? No, I'm here for it. The boots. It's yeah, the boots. The boots. <laughs> No, you actually, I've not been funny. This outfit is just amazing. I actually just love Lucinda's, it. Lucinda's, 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 Lucinda's. <laughs> Sorry guys, this is the cover. Oh, wow, honestly, <laughs> I'm sweating. So out of breath. No idea where we're going. There's literally no one to be seen. I'm so unfit, I have no idea. I'm gonna be running a half marathon. But maybe this is good practice, you know? Oh. Jesus Christ. Oh. Hey guys, so I've woken up, my eyes are bloodshot. I literally have no idea why. I've lost my voice, but it's okay. I've got changed. I'm actually wearing this and it's really annoying because it got um, makeup on it last night. Also, I don't know how much I picked up my camera last night. I think it was probably one clip of what I can remember. My voice is completely gone. And also, I have a nose... I had a nosebleed as well last night. And I think it's because of the altitude. Which isn't ideal, but it's what it is. Oh, my God. I can't actually talk. Em's here. And look at the actual state of our apartment as well. I actually... I think I'm going to blame you for that. Yeah. Because... It's just stuff everywhere. But anyway, we're going to have to quickly go because we're going to go get our skis. Just get going, really. I haven't gone for any makeup, but I think it looks like I've got those makeup on because I did put on um, a bit of Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter and a bit of blush, a bit of powder bronzer because I don't know where my cream bronzer's gone. I'm really, really just blabbering on now. And I am so super ill. It's, it's no joke, but... I've got to power through. But anyway, guys, I'm not going to take my camera because I know what I'm like. I will definitely lose it. And this is my second, third camera now. Third. This is my third camera, which is not good. Also, what on earth is going on with my voice? I don't sound normal. I will see you all very soon. Bye. Guys, yeah. this ski shop has got so many moon boots. I am so obsessed. I've actually got these, but I just didn't take them with me. Guys, look at our taxi to get to the tourist office because Emily slept on the ski pass and we ordered a horse and cart. Guys, this is actually hilarious. What are those called skis? Come now. Oh my god. I'm really funny, you just can't be hungover in a warm house because I feel like the fresh air just sorts me out. Oh, my voice is fine. Look where we are. We are in the mountains. My voice is well and truly gone. But yeah, I've had a great time. Thank you so much. You've been amazing. I am so hungover. Honestly, I don't feel normal. I'm so blocked up as well. I literally woke up and I couldn't even breathe. I've got problems in my left tummy um, and I think I'm dying. <laughs> but apart from that, I'm doing great. And I can't even speak because my voice is gone. It's been gone for the past two days. And I think, <laughs> and I think I'm dying. I can never guess what. Um, I've just met Gok Wan. What do you think of Gok? Oh my God. What do you think of Gok? He was great. He's lovely. He, had, he did a really good set, but this is not it. What do you mean? My face. Oh, you know what? You actually just get used to it. I've actually stopped catering. How cute are these earmuffs as well, by the way? They're massive. They're literally massive. They're like the size of my head. <laughs> They're just like two bits. I'm gonna, well, I think I filmed some stuff on my phone, so I'll try and insert that, but apart from that, I haven't really vlogged much. So, um, what do you think of your cheese gap? Right, I'm not a pippy eater, but that's for clet cheese, which I thought I really loved, but I've been drinking quite a lot, and I think the smell's just like, yeah, do you know what I mean? Vibes. I can't eat it. Um, 
I'm gonna have to just leave it because the smells making me feel ill. No, the, I've actually got a problem. I'm so hungover. She coughed in my mouth. I literally coughed in Emily's mouth. <laughs> no, I've got a problem. But no, you know what we're gonna do? Our makeup. Well, I'll do my makeup. I don't know if you're gonna do yours or not. Yeah, depends if you can be bothered or not. I probably will put makeup on just because look at me. I really feel like having a chilled one tonight. Should we just go for like a nice dinner? What are we going to buy something from the shop and make it? Yeah. Oh, I'll do that. We like make dinner. I feel like watching like a chalet girl oh, on the TV. Film night. Like chalet girl. No, there's a cinema here as well. Oh. Should we go to the cinema? <laughs> That's exactly, no, you know what, we've overdone it. I can't go, that's why, whenever I go to Ibiza, I go for a maximum three days, because I actually physically can't, unless you do one day drinking, one day off, one day drinking, one day off, but we have done that, and I am feeling slightly weird, I'm not gonna lie. We're sat in this restaurant, and it's currently raining outside, which just isn't vibes at all. It's not a very nice day at all, to be honest. It's not content day, is it really? No. Um, and I didn't take. Guys, I've literally been so bad for content this trip. It's just because we've just been having such a fun time. But I just haven't. Which is probably a good thing. I haven't thought, like, quickly take a picture. At the start, we did. And then, I mean, I took pictures just last night, but I didn't really look the best. I'd be standing in the rain and my hair was like damp and horrible. So, yeah. It's been so fun. Honestly, we, we were saying we haven't laughed. I haven't laughed like this in a very long time. Yeah, it's like, been like so... proper like belly laughs, just constantly. It's just been so Hasn't it been hilarious? Yeah. <laughs> but I think we've got a very similar sense of humour. Yeah, like yeah. Our sense of humour is very similar. So I think that's why we're laughing. No. Sometimes, you know, when you've got a completely different sense of humour than someone else, because I'm quite a sarcastic, like, yeah. very dry, dry. humour. Like, I'm, I'm very, like, but when I... Like, I find stuff like that really funny. <laughs> but when you're with someone and they don't find that funny, you're just there laughing and they're like... I'm not like a knock knock who's there girl. <laughs> I actually. <laughs> I'm gonna be looking back at this and being like, what? I'm not a knock knock who's there girl. Knock who's there? Right, guys, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Love you. I am the worst vlogger in the whole entire world. I haven't actually charged my camera the whole time I've been here, so I'm surprised it's still got like battery but that just goes to show that i actually haven't picked up the camera near as much as i'd want to but genuinely guys we've just had such a fun time and i think i've actually mentioned this before but i've just never like thought you know what and pick up the camera obviously i love you guys so much but that just means i'm really living in the moment which is good we're super hungover today so we've just been chilling out all day i actually just took an instagram picture we've done lots of work bits which we just can't avoid and we just had to do and now we're just going to go get some pizza or some food that's what we want but yeah i'll take you all along with me it's currently half six and em's come to wake me up um we are honestly so well like like so well completely blocked up here my throat now feels really horrible and like razor blades I just feel really tired and like not normal and we're just waiting here because we woke up a bit early and also look at the weather outside it was such a fun holiday but the weather has just been not thriving it's not just been fun today hey guys i am back feeling slightly awful not gonna lie i don't think the flu's gone mum's cooking some dinner i'll show you in a sec but this is the start of it happy sunday happy sunday how unreal well i'm saying how unreal it's literally well, uh, carrots and well, no. <laughs> you're just putting it to the moment no, this is not the full thing but it's over here it will be it will but be in a minute right? my battery is running out of charge so i'm gonna whack you quickly on charge back from skiing slightly ill but we power through so gravy over the yum yeah. or i love new that Yorkshire's. on the auctions as well really really you sound like me <laughs> right this one 
Me, Mum and you Have a great day. How I'm real. On a Sunday. Proper, proper. Living our best life. And also, guys, look what's arrived. I will get the money. Oh! Oh, oh, Mom! oh, oh! Kidding, no. kidding, uh, kidding. How I'm real. And I've got my right, come on, initials then. on them as well. I'm so happy I've got my hands on them. I absolutely love them. Does wow. Even. Thank you, Mum. You're welcome. So it's one week, sorry, I just had dinner, as you saw. Come back upstairs, and I think now, I don't look great. I think now, I'm just deep in the fact that it's one week until I run a half marathon. Like, I don't think I've actually, like, deeped how hard that's going to be. Ewan, do you want to do it with me? Yeah, go on then. Do you, when when is it? you able to just do it like that? When is it? It's um one week today. One week today? Yeah. Seven days to get in shape. Half marathon. Yeah, but you'd be able to do it. Probably would. Because you and you and one of those people that just um <laughs> caught me off guard there. You and one of those people that just sort of just cracks on with it. Can run like he can just run. I can't run. I don't even think I'd be able to do it like with loads of training. And guys, I haven't really been training recently. So I mean, I'm gonna do what I can. It's for a great cause but I am super ill. I flew home yesterday from Geneva and my ear still wasn't unpopped. Like, what the hell? Ow, and it still hurts. Like, the ear still hurts. It's obviously a sinus problem. But yeah, how cute is this cup that I got from Dress Mose? They actually gave it to me at the TikTok pop-up shop, which was lovely. Now I think I'm just going to chill out for the rest of the night. Not much, really, I'm doing. I'm just sort of chilling out. I mean, I know I keep it real on here, but it is currently honestly don't even look at what i look like it's currently 10 to 1 in the morning i'm trying to go to sleep for the past hour my ears still blocked so we landed from the airplane yesterday my ear is still blocked and it's like a ringing noise and my throat is not getting any better i actually feel slightly um breathless like i'm really not well and i'm really worried because obviously i'm doing this half marathon this weekend and I was really excited for it. I'm worried though. I knew I shouldn't have flown home because I was so ill. Oh my god, look at me. I knew I shouldn't have flown home because I was obviously so ill. But I had the flight then and I just wanted to come home. And that's obviously why my ear is so like blocked. I feel like it's got a bubble on it and I just don't know what to do. It was my best friend's birthday on Saturday night and I didn't go, which was so unlike me. I can't remember if I said that or not. I washed my hair and I literally just sat down and was like, I'm just way too well, which is so weird. Usually, unless I'm throwing up, I definitely would go. But this is just so bad. And I really wonder if it's that new, like, coronavirus. But I did do a test. I'm just so fed up of coughing and being unwell. I just want to be, like, healthy and well. As I'm filming this, I don't even know how loud I'm talking. Because I just feel like I can't hear anything because of my ear. So anyway, I'm going to try and watch something. I think it's obviously going to be a late night for me. Because, yeah, I just don't think I'm going to go to sleep anytime soon. Oh my goodness. Guys, you never guess what's happened. So, because of the launch of Hey You of the Real Housewives Goes to Thailand, I actually got a PR package. But I don't think I actually send showed you where's it gone i'll insert picture here of the pr package abby's here no. say hi hi yeah, no. um anyway you are chaotic a girl a lady has just come and she's gonna give me a massage oh, i'll show you honestly this is the best day of my life thank you so much hey you hold on here we go. <gasps> Exciting. I literally can't wait. What sort of massage will it be? A hot stone massage. So, um, it's an hour and a half. Um, Amazing. So you'll have a mixture of massage and hot stones. And a bit of face if you want. I've never had a hot stone massage oh, before. Lovely. This is literally amazing. Yeah. Did you get any branded towels or anything? Yeah, should I go get them? Get them, yeah, and then we can get yeah. them on your feet. Okay, hold on a sec. I'm wearing the robe that hey you got me. This is the best day ever, honestly. It's been such a lovely day. I've done an ad. 
I mean, the scars on my face from those spots really need to go. That's not adding to today. But I just sent an ad and I was doing like some skincare stuff. So I feel really relaxed anyway. And now I'm getting a hot stone massage. It's going to take an hour and a half. So long. Right, come on then. Yard. But that's chocolate and that's aromatherapy. So if you want to smell one of those and decide uh, which one you want. I thought it would be a good idea. <laughs> 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 that's what it smells like chocolate. It is chocolate. You can eat it. It's so organic. You can drink it. Stop. Yeah. Right, let me try this one. But that's, that's probably nicer, actually, the aroma this one. one. Yeah. Yeah. It'll be more beneficial for you. Do you think? Yeah. I'm not feeling 100% well, right, by the okay. way. So just quite a cough. But nothing, it's not COVID or anything. So everyone, I've just had my hot stone massage. It was so lovely. Thank you, Alison. She's just packing away now. Honestly, absolutely amazing. If anyone wants to book you in this area, how do they, how do they book you? Um, you can go through either Ruby app. Ruby app. Yeah. You said that and I haven't heard of it before. Um, it's mainly in London. Oh, okay. So, um, but they're like branching out. So yeah, Ruby, you can book it through there. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Oh, it was lovely. I mean, sometimes I literally come on my YouTube and I'm like, I could have brushed my hair. Like I actually could have brushed my hair. Do you know what I mean? What is this? You know why I look like this? I don't know if this is better without or with. Maybe it's better if I just don't even do it with that. You know why my hair's in absolute state? It's because I just got a massage and it was literally the best thing ever. It's currently Monday, the 27th of March. I'm going on a half marathon on Sunday. I haven't been able to train. I'm so ill. Honestly, pray for me. Carl's coming to go get his clip. I'm just ending the vlog. Do you want to come and end it with me? Carl's coming to edit the vlog now. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> I'll leave you for a second. Okay, I'll see you in a minute. I'm really, really ill. Don't know what I'm going to do. I might die. I might not. I'm just doing it for a good cause. Do you know what I mean? I can walk it if, if, if worse comes to worse. As always, I'll link the Mind Charity Just Giving page underneath. But it's also in my TikTok and Instagram bio. Honestly, guys, every little helps. I mean, you literally don't need to die at all. But if it is a charity that's close to your heart, literally... 50p is lots do you know what i mean anything absolutely anything or nothing at all honestly there's no pressure at all to to sponsor the marathon at all i'm really really excited i am sort of excited i'm a bit nervous i'm not gonna lie because i'm just so ill i also had to pick up um this prescription i don't know what's going on with the lights in this car this prescription which is ear spray because i went to the doctor today and they were like, yeah, you've got an infection in your throat. I was like, love that, love my life. But they were like, well, you just have to, basically have to rest. And I was like, oh. And I was actually too scared to tell her I was actually doing a half marathon on Sunday. But I've also got ear spray because I've got an infection in my ear. Love my life. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave you all there. I don't actually know how much footage I got. But can I just say a massive thank you to Hulu today for giving me a massage at my house. That was just chef's kiss. But yeah, I will see you all very soon. Love you all lots and subscribe if you want to like the video if you want to and i love seeing all of your comments because youtube is literally the best place ever because i love you all so much bye